the Illuminati? Was what well, I mean to your best of your knowledge, was Jay, is Jay, a part of any of those organizations? Yeah, I can't say for a fact because I never went to a large meeting with him. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But me doing my research and and that whole organization, you know, the whole masonry, Freemasonry mm -hmm. thing. Mm -hmm. You know, I see things that make my antenna go up. Mm -hmm. You know, whether it's hand signals, mm -hmm. you know, different things. So, I don't know for a fact, but I know that from what I've seen that he's in, in, a, in a different category than your normal person. So, you can't really say, you, you don't know for a fact that Jay is or is an Illuminati, but he has some inf influential people around him and the moves that he might have been making may have suggested that he might have been masonry or Illuminati. Right. I, I mean, I, to me, Illuminati is a blanket name mm. for secret okay. society. Secret society. Because you, you, know, you have your masons, right. you have your Freemasons. Right. You have something in the industry which is called like the gay boule. You know. My or black boule? Is it black boule or gay boule? It's the, they got the gay boule. They got the black secret yeah. society, which I thought was black boule. Yeah, okay. or black. You, that's a new yeah. title. Like, mm -hmm. so when somebody say Illuminati, right? You know, that's like saying cheese. You got Thousands American cheese. cheese, Swiss cheese. You know, provolone. Right. You know, what right, I'm saying? right, so, right. You know, anybody could get denied being an Illuminati, right? Because you're not being specific in what you're doing, right? You know, just like, you know. George Bush, everybody knows he's part of the Skull and Bones. Exactly. But if you ask him, he'll probably he say it's a secret. If you ask Jay, if, is he down with the Illuminati? Right. You know, he's going to say, you know, no. Right. Because it's a secret, so he can't say. It. But if you do your research mm -hmm. and you you look at certain things and you watch out for, you know, hand signals mm -hmm. and things like that, mm -hmm. then it raises your antenna to the belief right. that, that it might may be. be true. And if it wasn't true, why are you addressing it? If it don't apply, let it fly, right? Let it fly. He did a song with Rick Ross called what? <laughs> right, right, Free Mason. Mason. Huh? He said, I didn't say that I was a Mason, I said that I'm amazing. You see certain rappers Woo. can't get on Oprah, but well, he can. It that's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? So you put it together, you know what I'm saying? You figure it out for yourself. You know what I'm saying? Right. And maybe that's the reason why they ain't have to go. Right. Maybe that's the reason why all the other artists are going. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Do so, you, uh, let, let, me, let me ask this real briefly. Crazy enough has it been, uh, did, did Jay, I mean, did Dane really sleep on Jay's business sense? And you can't credit Jay for his success. By himself, okay. you know John Minnelli, okay. his manager, his manager, done a lot. Okay, Steve Stout, Steve Stout, done a lot. What up, Steve? You know what I'm saying? Okay. And then Dane didn't have the help from a John Minnelli or Steve, Steve Stout. Stout, right? So you know, you can't say that he's more of a businessman than Dane is. I, I don't believe that. If, trust mm -hmm. me, if Dane would have took over Def Jam, I guarantee you he would have did more for Def Jam than Jay did. Dane would be the president now. Wow. And I guarantee you he would do more than what LA Reed did. Rockefeller is done. Huh? No yeah. more. Dame is has went on. What is Dame doing right now, man? Your guess is as good as mine. I know he got the artist currency, he still got his label, DDMG, Dame Dash Music Group. Right. Uh, some numbers behind that. Right. I don't know what that what it stand for, but right. you know, I got nothing bad to say about him. Right. I mean Saying, you know, he's an egotistical maniac, everybody right. knows that. You right, know right, 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 right. But he's a smart brother. I wish, you know, they give him an opportunity to get back in the game. Because exactly. hip hop is dying. Right. And at a fast, alarming rate. Great. If they were to put him in a position, right. hip hop would still be alive. We might have dudes running around with their sister jeans on. <laughs> You know, tight, skinny jeans <laughs> and the craziness, you know what I'm saying? I've heard it here first. Uh, Swag DVD in the building, your man APZ, your man Clev. Choke is right here, right now. Choke. Y'all yeah, come to Black Star. There we go. Y'all get my DVD. Put it up there close. I am Choke No Joke. Right. That's a documentary. It's my life, you know, compressed into uh, almost two hours. 
There's footage on there from the tunnel. Mm. You know, is Rockefeller footage. Tunnel DVD. Mm. I didn't know that. Tunnel 4, the best of Jay-Z. Come to, you know, Black Star Video. Go to www.blackstarvideo.com. Y'all can purchase it there. They'll ship it to you. Don't matter if y'all in England, they'll ship it to y'all. All right? Early, we always keep a digital swag DVD. Lions, tigers, and bears, baby. Lions, tigers, and bears. Which one are you, cuz? Exactly. He didn't took it. He didn't know what it is. Swag is in the building. Choke is in the building. Black Star, we digital on you. Holla at us. 2011 to 2012, kid. Keep it pumping. Keep it hot, man. Swag is in the building. Ah! Uh -huh.